Hey guys, welcome to Tabi Eats. Today we're in the mood for pumpkin and so we're gonna be making a beautiful pumpkin gratin. It's a simple dish with French origins, but gratins are extremely popular here in Japan and it's always been one of my favorites. This is also a collaboration with Huang who will also be making something delicious with pumpkin. Hi everyone, this is Huang from Hobu Cooking Channel. Today I want to show you how to make a very tasty and nutritious dish, the pumpkin soup. You definitely gonna love it. So make sure to come over at the end of this video and check it out. See you later! So make sure to visit her video at the end. Without further ado, let's get started. Today we'll be using a quarter of a small pumpkin, one white onion, a cup of mushrooms of your choice, a couple of broccoli florets, a few slices of ham, a cup of shredded cheese and some grated parmesan, one and a quarter cup milk, a teaspoon of granulated consomme, four tablespoons flour, four teaspoons butter, salt and pepper to taste. First, let's blanch our broccoli in some boiling water with a little bit of salt. Once they're done, take them out and set them aside. Now let's make two thin slices from our pumpkin. Then we're going to cut those into three pieces each, making six small slices. These are going to be used to decorate the top of your gratin. Now we're going to cut the rest of the pumpkin into small 2 inch blocks. Now I don't know about you but my mother always told me it's easier to cut raw pumpkin with the skin side up. I do find it a lot easier this way, however you're cutting it just be careful not to cut yourself. Now put the cut up pieces into a bowl and cover with plastic wrap. Then we're going to microwave this for about 4 minutes or until they're soft but not mushy. Next, let's slice our onions and once you're done with this, set them to the side. It's time to check our pumpkins. I think they're just about done, so be very careful when taking the wrap off because it's very hot. Let's go on to our mushrooms by slicing them into small pieces. Today we're using white mushrooms and shimeji mushrooms. Feel free to use your favorites. Cut up your ham or your favorite deli meat into bite-sized pieces. If you're a vegetarian, please use deep fried tofu, that's a great substitute. Now we're going to make our white sauce. So let's melt our butter in a frying pan. Then we're going to add the onions and the mushrooms. I'm going to cook this until the onions are almost translucent. Then it's time to add our ham pieces and cook it for another minute or so. Bring your heat down to low and evenly sprinkle the flour over the vegetables. Cook it over low heat mixing to incorporate the flour throughout. Now. Add your milk one third at a time, stirring after each addition. Make sure to dissolve the flour every time you add the milk. This is how we're going to be making our simple bechamel sauce. Continue to do this until all your milk is used up. At this point, we're going to add a granulated consomme and mix it in. Continue cooking until the sauce starts to thicken up just like this. And now it's time to add our pumpkins. I'm going to cook this for another 3 minutes. Now adding your pumpkins last will help prevent them from becoming too mushy. Finally, we're going to season it with some salt and pepper to taste. And if you like, a dash of cinnamon will give it a beautiful flavor. Now let's divide this into 2 oven safe dishes. Or if you prefer, just use your favorite baking pan. Let's top it off with some shredded cheese and decorate it with a broccoli floret. This will add some color making it pretty to look at. Finally, we're going to top them with a few slices of the thin pumpkin slices. I'm going to give it a final sprinkle with some grated parmesan cheese. This is optional but adding some breadcrumbs will add some crunch. Now we're going to bake them for 15 to 20 minutes at 180 degrees C or 360 degrees F. And once they are done, carefully take them out of the oven and eat them while they are hot. They can be a complete meal on their own but also makes a great side dish. Okay, our gratins are ready and they are piping hot so you have to be careful. When they come out right out of the oven, it's really really hot so just be careful guys. I think mm. it's a great harmony of pumpkin sweetness and uh, white sauce. It is. 
It is. And I love the ham. The ham gives it so much flavor. I love pumpkin. Mm, how is it? Mmm. That's good, isn't it? Mmm. Wonderful. Right? Mm. Yeah. Mm. For me, it's not autumn without pumpkin. Pumpkin is one of my favorite vegetables. Is it a vegetable? Vegetable. Yeah, okay. So glad I wasn't wrong. <laughs> so if you love pumpkins, definitely try this one out because I think you will love this. We hope you enjoyed today's recipe. If you did, please give this a thumbs up and make sure you leave us a comment down below to let us know what you guys thought. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for 5 weekly videos. Finally, make sure to visit Huang's channel to see what she made for you guys. Thanks so much for watching and see you guys again soon. Bye bye!